Okay, here's another uh, strange configuration you've probably never seen before. That's a homemade uh, electric motor called a Newman motor driving a homemade electrostatic generator driving a homemade electrostatic motor with an electroscope to show the, show the charge. And um, actually the main reason I did this was I wanted to see if these carbon brushes would work on a regular electric motor and they don't. The uh, carbon uh, fibers just just burn up because of the amperage, and that's the difference between that situation there and that situation. Is this is an amperage kind of thing here? This is high voltage, low amperage, and that's why these little aluminum brushes here don't melt. Is it's high voltage but very very low amperage, so you get away with uh, some things that you can't get away with a regular motor. But uh, yeah, this is a little Newman motor. Look it up. Uh, there's lots and lots and lots of videos on how to make that. And like I say, I wanted to see if um, I could make it uh, drive this electrostatic generator, and it does. Um, a couple of things on this little motor here. Um, this is a motor I would recommend um, the kids build. If you're a teacher watching my videos, you might want to put together a project to build one of these Newman motors. They're extremely simple. And that's just one coil of wire. It's wrapped around that tube with an axle going through the middle drive shaft and some magnets that are attached to that shaft. You uh, lay one side of the wire on the shaft here and you make a commutator uh, with a make and break point right here. I use a correction fluid with a gap in the middle and you just attach the battery to that one side of the motor and it runs and it's an extremely simple motor to make and the advantage is it's got torque and you can drive things with it and that's one of the reasons I, I wanted to make that motor was to see if I could uh, make something that would drive this electrostatic generator which would drive the motor anyway that's something a little uh, different uh, you don't see every day an electrostatic uh, generator driven by a Newman motor and then an electrostatic motor running off the generator. <laughs> it's kind of a Rube Goldberg thing, and uh, I get a kick out of making these things. Thanks for watching.